What's up, everybody? It's John with John Sports. I just come back to the brand new video. How's everyone doing today? It is Throwback Thursday time. And um, I thought about it all week. Like, what am I going to do for this Throwback Thursday? We've been showcasing sets and and uh, older product and things like that. And I kind of was like, eh, I don't want to do a set this week. We've got some coming up. Let's do those in the later weeks. And then... Um, you know, we've got a lot of oddball, oddball product coming up as well. And I had this sitting here uh, on our pile of to-do uh, items. So this is the last uh, Fairfield product that we have in the household here. It's one of these Fairfield cubes. You've seen this open up these before. Um, and I actually talked about this particular one, oh, about a month or so ago, maybe. We'd found three of these at uh, at Target. Actually, two, and I went back and purchased this one. Um, these started showing up at Target's about a month, a couple months ago, actually. And uh, I found two that had these uh, Alex Bregman um, kind of uh, a short print uh, rookie cards that were part of the actual set for that year. And then there were two Andrew Benintendi ones there. And I went back, and there was only one left, so I picked this up, and that's what this is. So we're going to show you that card that's in here and see what other little... Little things we can find inside here um, inside this Fairfield Cube. You can pick these up, like I said, for $4.99. Uh, they do have them at Targets. They, they sell them at Five Below occasionally. Um, here's their ben, Andrew Benintendi card there. We're going to get that out so you can see it's a different uh, photo variation there. We have the opening day pack. It's probably going to be Donruss. Um, the other pack would probably be Donruss, which is fine. Um, and then here is an anyone score. Excuse me, uh, Kane Man. Uh, Roger Clemens um, card there. He's on the on the ballot for the hall. Uh, what did he have? I can't remember the percentage where he was sitting. Both he and Bonds were kind of sitting in this like 50, 50, high 50 percentage kind of uh, number there. The other pack, that's a 1990. It looks like Donner. So that's not as good as we would like to get. So inside here, so you know, just took a quick little review. 112 cards, two packs, four star cards, one Hall of Fame card, five cards from each of the past five decades. They don't always put those in here in the storage cube. So let's get this open. This wrapper off. This is like stuck on here. Normally they come right off, but this is like sticking bad. And um, yeah, so tomorrow we have an awesome treat for you. And you're going to want to watch that video on Friday. Let's get into this. Let's see what we can find out of here. Sometimes these things are good. Sometimes they're terrible. And, uh, you know, a lot of comments and whatnot. But we've actually, you know, had a couple of things come out here that have been pretty, pretty good um, over the last year. Uh, we've had, um, we found a, a Chipper Jones uh, Meyer League card in one of these. I don't think we ever pulled any autos out of these cubes or anything like that. Those are normally not in here. But we have pulled autos out of the beer filled pharmacy boxes and whatnot. Um, all right, let's see what we have, but yeah, so, you know, these, these are, these are fun to do. It's our last one. Uh, we love the Fairfield, Fairfield products. They are, they are really good. Here's the other pack. It's like 1990. Leave those there. Uh, we do like the Fairfield products. They've been very good to us this past year. Uh, sending me a lot of, um, a lot of newer product, um, from like the August time frame throughout the fall. We should we showcase a lot of that here on the channel. So let's uh, check this stuff out. So here's the Benintendi card. Looks to be uh, pretty decent shape. The corners look pretty good. The cut's pretty good. Um, a little, no, so not too bad. Let's showcase this one. We have a bunch of these working cards on. We do not have this one. And as you can see here, it's from the complete set from 2017. So let's highlight that. Let's get into these cards. Let's see what we can find. There's Bucky Evan Dent right there. To get myself situated. Okay. Randy Dahmer, Sorrento. It's Albert Bell. Skybox. Dominion. Uh, Preston Wilson. This is Victory. I don't know if they were all blue. So the Preston Wilson. Uh, rookie Cup card for Mr. Preston Wilson. It really did very much, Preston Wilson, from what I can recall. Um, okay, let's get back to this. A really beat up 88 or 89 uh, tops record breaker for George Bell. It's pretty bad. Uh, 87 tops Howard Johnson. There's Mickey Morandini. Leaf. 
Got an 81 Dahmer, Sparky Lyle, Quisenberry from 87 Tops, 90 Mike Felder, Mike Maddox, Upper Deck was 90, what year is this one, from 93. Uh, 91 Donruss, Tim Leary, got a Matt Noakes Cup card here. What else? Greg Litton, 91 Score, Daryl Brought Boston from um, 91 Donruss. All the overproduced years. Carlos Martinez of $90. Dan Gladden. Let's see. That's from 89. $90. Eric Show, Tim Tuffle, and Barry Lyons. Then we go into some 91s. Sandy Van Slyke, Mike Fetters, 88 Tops, Dan Plesak, 89 Tops, Chris Brown, Mark Parrott. Got an itch there, sorry. This is from 92. Rick Sutcliffe. I don't know why I flipped it over, I should know. Uh, Frank Viola and Darren Dreifert, Team USA card. 92 Tops. 90 Tops, Bucky F. and Dent. Paul Kilgus. Back to 92, Dave Gallagher. It's Eddie Murray from 89 Donruss. Oh, heck, I'll pull the Hall of Famers. I might have missed somebody that was in there, I don't know. Rafael Palmero from 90 Tops. Danny Leone, 92. BJ Wallace, Team USA card. Jose Canseco. If you hear wind howling in the background, it is super cold and snowing, and it is uh, very, very windy. Uh, Pete Falcone from 79 Tops. Put that aside. It's a really older, much older card. I'll just leave it in here. Uh, Tahi Garrett from 86, Ted Simmons, okay, Hall of Famer right there, boom, just got in, uh, that is from 84, from 84, the commemorative set, I don't know if this is the mail-in one or not, comment down below if you know, uh, Jose Canseco from 91 Studio, yep, uh, and here's Daryl Strawberry, and here's Louis Tiant. We're working on this 82 set now. So this is cool. I don't know if I have this one. I got to double check. We'll put it aside, though. Um, so these are also good, if, you know, for set builders, too. They like, you know, they like to find these old cards near them. So that's a good thing about these products, too, as well. Because uh, we have actually pulled some cards out of this and on sets that we, we have been working on and found maybe one or two. So that was good. So there's Louis Tiant from 82 Tops. They're on the Pittsburgh Pirates. Willie Randolph in action. Two of them. Got an 85 uh, Tops Bob Welch. Welsh, uh, Jesse Orozco, 87, John Franco, 88, Domers, Rafael Palmero, second year card, uh, Chuck McElroy, Fleer Ultra. All right, next little stack here, Claudel Washington from 90 score, Julio Valera from 91, is that 90 or 91? 92, sorry, very small there. And two upper deck. Uh, Lee Guterman. Just so you know, guys, sometimes when I say I can't see this stuff, I wear reading glasses when I'm looking up, when I'm this, you know, uh, for some of these things. And sometimes the lighting is bad. It's hard to read. So some people make some horrible comments below about it, too. It's like, come on. Be careful. You're getting knocked out. <laughs> okay, Lee Guterman. Uh, here's the Padres. Uh, little uh, hologram sticker thing. Um, Steve Traxel, this is from 97, I believe, 97 Tops, uh, 90, let's see what year is, 92, sorry, 92, uh, Diamond Debut, Diamond Debut, Debuts, <laughs> Mark Clark, Tommy Green from 93 Fleer, Ultra, whoops, these are stuck, Randy Stefano and Jose Mesa. 87 Donruss, Jose Mesa, 92 Fleer. Um, here's Russell Mormon. As the card goes flying. Uh, Russell Mormon, 87 Donruss. 87 Fleer, love this year. Fleer is a great Mike Jackson. Here's another one, Juan Castillo. Castillo. Uh, this is what year of score is this? I should know this too. This is 89. Zane Smith. Mark Antonelli. Rookie card. Bowman. 
2007, no, eight, sorry, nine. 2009, Brian Williams, 92 Flair Ultra. These were high end back then, too, big time. I did Concepcion. I uh, just show, show, showcased this set a little bit ago. 1988 Tops. Here's Rusty Meacham. 93 Fleer. Got a Luis Salazar. 85 Tops. 90 Tops. Rick Luchin. I think I pronounced that right. Uh, 87 Tops. Steve Buscelli. Bud Black from 87 Donruss. Ozzy Guillaume from 89 Tops. You got a gold uh, 92. Kurt Manwaring. Yep, 92. Luis Gonzalez from Tops. What year is this one from? 97. 96, sorry. 96, I believe. Okay. We don't have anything from that year at all. Uh, Mickey Morandini, as far as baseball goes. Really anything, I don't think. Um, kind of cuts off at 90 something. 94, 95 for me, for our collection. Uh, that's a really bad car. They should not have put in here. You can see that stain. That's so weird. That's not anything you want to even put in. In fact, that's going to go in the trash can. You can see the back here, too. Wow. OPG, man. Messed it up bad. I don't know if they're, one of the red from the car that was on here. Yeah, you can see. Must have bled on here. That's pretty bad. Okay. Um, 91 Tops, Jay Howell, uh, Raider Rookie, Rick Serhoff, whoop, whoop, 86 Donruss, got Paul Asimacher, Top Stadium Club, from 92, Edgardo Alfonso, Todd Froworth, let's keep going here, Jason Schmidt, Rookies and Stars, I believe that's a Leaf product, Ron Robinson, 87 Donruss, Greg Holland, or Greg Holland, Al Holland, sorry. 82 Tops, Tony Armas, 87 Donruss, Barry Jones, 90 Score, Jose Cruz, 83 Tops. Look out for that set. We're going to be showcasing that uh, soon, too, as well. Um, we're almost done uh, just putting that, finishing that one up. Um, Julio Mar Marcado, Marchado. Jerry Royce with the bat there. Whoops, 89 Fleer. Some more 89 Fleer action coming up. Tim Leary. Nice Gary Carter. Okay. Bobby Bonilla, Bobby Bo, and Ricky Aguilera. Newer cards here. Bartolo Colon. 2017. Kendall Graveman. Francisco Lindor. Ryan Schimpf. Chad Pinder, rookie card. Some Mucina, Hall of Famer right there. Um, that is Upper Deck. It's actually a nice card. They could have showcased that over the Clemens, and people might have been into it. Uh, Roger Clemens from 89. Barry Bonds, Upper Deck. Okay, so some names, you know, two guys that are on the ballot right now. Roger Clemens is from the 91 score. Okay, so there you go. So... You know, not too bad. Typical Fairfield stuff, you know, not too bad. All right, let's find what's in these packs. Let's do this Donruss one. Whoops, and then we could do the opening day. I won't get anything out of either one. These Donruss packs have been, like, really bad on these products lately. You can see they're just completely stuck to the to the card. Um, and it's ruined an MVP-looking-like card, and it looks like it might be, gosh, Don Mattingly. That sucks. No, it's Boston. Sorry, Tim Dorn. That was an um, MVP card. Not Don Mattingly. Tim Drummond, and it's ruined. Let's go in the trash. It's a puzzle piece. All right, Rick Honeycutt. We've seen this many, many times. We don't need to highlight them again, but there's... You know, I don't mind this. I don't mind this. There's some people who call this one of the worst sets, along with the... Uh, was it 91 Fleer, the yellow borders? I mean, I like actually both of those. So, you know, some of these guys, they get really, really picky and are super uptight about um, their cards. And I pretty much like everything. It's very hard for me not to not to to, to like something. So, uh, in this in this hobby. Rick Honeycutt, Billy Hatcher, Joe Magrain, Magrain, uh, Diamond Kings, Mike Fitzgerald, Mark Guthrie, 
Oral Hershiser, Roberto Kelly, Tommy Herr, Al Leiter, Dennis Rasmussen, Rasmussen, Mike Scott, Brooke Jacoby, Steve Avery, Raider rookie. Okay, not too bad. Um, Randy Velarde, and then Pat Combs, Raider rookie. So, a couple good, decent Raider rookies out of there. Let's see what's in this opening day pack. All right. All right, Tim Anderson. He had a great year this last year, so let's see what he does this coming year. Starts us out. Oh, nice Aaron Judge cup cards. So that's not too bad. Yeah, we'll highlight. We'll highlight that. Why not? Let's put old Mr. Judge back there. Got to highlight something out of this. Okay, Justin Bohr. We got uh, team traditions and celebrations. Take me out to the ball game. We all know that. Not just for our, our games that we go to, but everybody's. And then the the uh, the famous one where they uh, where Harry Carey used to sing in front of the booth, and then they have special guests do it. Or do they have special guests do it? And Harry Carey would be there doing it as well. I don't know. But anyway, Nikki Delmonico, rookie card. Okay. Jake Lamb. And we end with Anthony Rendon. Had a really sensational year last season for the Washington Nationals and led them to the... Uh, World Series. So, hey guys, we got lots of cool videos coming up. First of all, uh, if you're not subscribed, you like what you see here, that subscribe button right below my index finger there as I pull it away from the camera, a little bit clear. Gives me a thumbs up. It's our last Fairfield product, I promise. Uh, we don't have anything actually left. So, this was just sitting there, and I wanted to do uh, put a video out today, but thought, you know, let's go with something a little bit different. Like I said in the beginning of this, you know, it can showcase a set and all that stuff, or, you know, pull out some other older product that we have. Uh, but we're saving some things just as, you know, as we get here into the winter months. So uh, this is sitting there. I thought this might be ideal to do uh, on a Throwback Thursday. And, you know, because there's older cars in here and whatnot. So um, share this with your friends, family, and loved ones. Comment down below. The eBay store link is down below in the description. You know, we got a mixture of different stuff in here. Um, you know, some cars from 82. One, you know, Jose Cruz from 83. Um, you know, but the A2s were working on a set, finishing up that, so we'll go and see if those cards are missing. Some Hall of Famers in here, we might have, uh, missed a couple, uh, but, you know, not too bad cards, and then, um, what else? That was pretty much it. Oh, Andrew Benintendi, that's really the reason why I picked this up, because of that, um, this, like, parallel, not parallel, this, like, short print type card from the complete set from 2017, so there you go with that. That will go back, and that will go in our collection. This judge will go in there, too. We've got a bunch of those. What else can I tell you? So tomorrow, we've got a great video. You're going to want to see that. It is an older product, extremely rare. Um, and uh, I did mention before, it's the uh, Topps Fun Bag. And uh, it's cool. We are gonna we tried doing one before uh, about a week ago. And it was a complete and utter failure. I ended up scrapping the video because the cards were destroyed. Because it looked like there had been some sort of moisture uh, damage inside uh, of the bag somehow um, probably the way that these people stored it uh, and they sold it they had like one picture on ebay and it was not even like the bag that they sent us and uh, it was awful and they gave us a full refund and there had been another one that I had my eye on I cut a deal with the guy and he was really cool about it and it just arrived today so we're gonna show that to you tomorrow and you're gonna want to watch that I have a feeling it's gonna be pretty pretty cool so it looks to be a lot better um, as far as the uh, the um, the product inside goes, and hope you know. Knock on wood. <laughs> Hopefully, it isn't going to be uh, damaged goods inside, but I don't think it will be. It looks pretty cool. So that's it for today, guys. So you want to stick around for that tomorrow? Again, if you're not a subscriber, hit that subscribe button. And uh, we do have a giveaway coming up. I'm working on it, so bear with me there. We're we just went over 2,400 subscribers. And I, I owe you guys a giveaway from 2,000 subscribers. So I'm just building up the product that we're going to give out to everybody. Uh, it's going to be really easy to enter. I sh I'm hoping I can get a video up next week for it once I finish up everything. It's going to be a combination of things out of our collection. Like some, um, I don't know, give it a while away. But it's going to be stuff from the collection and then also uh, some new sealed product too. So we're going like, to do a nice giveaway as a way of saying thank you for supporting our channel. That's enough of me babbling right now. Uh, have a great rest of the evening, guys. New videos in the way tomorrow, so look out for that. That's it for today, guys. Thanks again for watching. This is John John Sports Card signing off. Hey, we'll see you on the next